Oh yeah, it is pumping, huh? Interesting. Get rid of this shit. Ah, yes, sir. See the monthly chart. So there is something, there is some good news here if anyone's interested. You've held, we hold this line. There's a, there's a little bit of a hold here. All right. There's a little bit of a hold there. Um, potentially we're on support, potentially. We still got big resistance at the launch price. So we've held, we've held the 236, okay. Don't know what to say. Shocking. It's quite good volume in the lows, huh? So this is quite bullish. This volume in the lows is bullish. Holding this two three six is bullish. That's bullish right now. I'm seeing some bullish price action right now. This previous low here was important and this two month candles held it here now the price is is pushing away from it it's quite bullish price action that i'm seeing on these higher time frame candles um i do feel like we still have big resistance ahead of us the next big resistance is going to be at 0 0.06 487 uh this is around this level here and then your your major resistance is going to be up here uh at 20 cents you've got really big resistance at 20 cents and um but at the moment getting back above this 236 coming back into this previous low here holding that as support Potentially now forming a reversal. Uh, arguably, I'm starting to see a little bit of bullish price action. You have got volume here, which is what you want to see. And um, yeah. Okay. Potentially, this is quite good. Actually, I like this. Now I'm now. <laughs> you see, that's how the that's how crypto is. You go from one bearish bias, and then suddenly you become bullish because you see a change in the price action. Potentially, actually, I'm just thinking of my about I'm thinking about this. I mean, potentially that was a higher high because look, lower lows. It's going up. Huh? I think the real sign of strength now will be to take that high up. I think you'll probably see quite an impulsive move if we if we can we can take this high out actually. Three, three, nine. Potentially. Look at that. So there's a there's a very definite like s s s s r flip here to see how the price kind of reacts here here and then here and then here further back All right maybe this is bullish i don't know 
this daily candle is a very strong reversal candle you see this it's a it's a daily reversal of the previous day um we're looking at continuation today but maybe it needs to pull back i don't know you are you have formed a brand new liquidity level there it's a daily level and actually that's what you want to do now you want to start creating strong levels underneath us as the price moves up okay um all right we'll have to monitor this and see what happens you also have a, a monthly level lower down so there is pretty strong support now here see that you have a monthly level you have a daily level you have this 236 you have this s uh this sr flip lower down here so you have pretty strong support right now underneath us anything on the weekly time frame depending on how this week ends you have a really strong weekly level formed here as well see that so actually what you have right now is very strong support here it's very strong support there's a trade here to be had here uh i don't like buying the pumps but this is the trade oh god why is that right there you don't really want to go down now like i, I just think that would be weird right I think for the price to do this would be very weird, especially since we've just created a monthly level, a daily level. And tomorrow, if as long as we don't close lower than this, the week open, we're going to create a weekly level. Right. So there's quite strong uh, levels underneath us. And you have this two, three, six on the higher time frame fib pool. And you have this previous low, which is acting as support. You see that I've marked it SFP. But actually, it's uh, I changed that to SR flip support resistance flip. Okay, so we've, we effectively what I'm seeing in this price action is we flip that level from resistance into support. Um, there's a trade here to be had, and the first, if this is going to now suddenly go to the moon, then your first significant take profit is around 20 cents so you're looking at at the moment with the current with this current trade that i have in mind we have quite a wide invalidation uh you're looking at a risk to reward ratio of 1 to 12 okay you just don't want the price to go down that i think that would be wrong i think worst case scenario This is a worst case scenario it goes down picks up liquidity higher low here and then it goes up and best case scenario we just go up you just go up okay uh, i think if it just go up as long as we can flip this next level into support then you're going up to the next level it's always it's always the same thing you want to it's level to level you have these major levels in the way you have the 388 the 382 at 0.064 and you have the 0 0.5 which is the 50 percent of the range which is at 0 0.11 and then the big level is the launch price which is just underneath the 0 0.618 which is the golden pocket that's going to be your your biggest resistance by the time the price gets up there up to there from our current price action that's a four and a half x okay so just bear that in mind okay and that's it that's gary for for the moment that's my gary update so i hope everyone everyone enjoys that i've i've literally just in the last five minutes ten minutes flipped to bullish all right so let's see i'm gonna have lunch now so thanks for tuning in and then i'll see you tomorrow <laughs> and don't forget to check out my trvo update and like 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 Thanks. See ya. See ya, everyone. See ya.